All right. Hello and welcome to our playthrough of Lord of the Rings, the mm -hmm. board game. Yes. Um, our channel is Game for Gamers. Yes. My name is Morbid. I'm your host, and this is my son. Um, too. Yep. And we're going to have a little crazy today. We're using every expansion for this game. Yes. We've got the main game, we've got Friends and Foes, and we've got Battlefields. And today we're using the Sauron expansion. Yes. Which normally this game is a competitive game, I mean cooperative. Yes. With one player playing Sauron, because the expansion allows you to do that, yep, it, uh, it um, co becomes a competitive game. I have no chance He's of winning. He's playing everyone else. Yeah, I have no chance of winning this, but we just want to see what it's like, just to go crazy with it, just to show you guys it. Yep. Um, there's new Gandalf cards with the expansion. <coughs> when I said new Gandalf cards. There's a new piece of Black Rider, which will go up and down the line, and if he reaches the ring bearer, turns around and gets back to Mordor, we lose. If the ring bearer gets caught by Sauron, we lose. There's eight or more foes on line in return, we lose. So a lot of ways to lose here. Yes. Um, there's some new feature cards involved in and every character gets a new ability. Um, there's also these resource tokens on the fourth and last spot of each line, which gives us stuff. Um, mm -hmm. I'm going to be playing all five characters, so I'm going to probably miss stuff. And I got a couple of special, this came with a Sauron expansion, a couple of special cards. I won't give too much away. I'll, I'll show you when I play it. And he's I got one. I also have a special card. Yeah, he's got one too. These are like promotional cards or something. Um, so what does a Sauron player do? Um, when we are instructed to roll the dice, instead he activates and plays a Sauron card and... I have to suffer all the consequences on that card. Yeah. Sauron also activates at the beginning of each turn. When he does that, he picks a Sauron card, and I have to suffer one of the icons. So usually there's like two or three icons on each Sauron card. And actually, yeah. you um, it says in the rule book, Sauron does not take turns. Instead. The Sauron player is activated in two instances. When a Fellowship player is instructed to roll the die, and at the start of every Fellowship player's turn. Okay. I have that book. There, uh, this also comes with 23 dark tiles. Now these dark tiles are a game variant. And you want to show a couple of them. And you can use them. If you choose to use them, you can pick a tile and if you don't like the tile, you can get away. Now, all 23 of these are bad. I'm yeah, not adding to these to the to the deck because it's. it's like I mean, I, I have no chance of winning now. There's dice. no way I'm gonna even have. Event. Yeah, it wouldn't be a game with Either those. Either Sauron moves or draw two foes. Another event. Loads of bad cards. Yeah, and there is four other special Sauron event tokens, which are mixed with the original three. They are now put in this bag. This bag does come with the expansion. So, they're all in here and I pull out of the bag now instead of just a regular discard pile. Yeah. So I'm trying to mix this up the best I can. Yeah. Matter of fact, why don't you mix up a little bit? He also has Nazgul cards. That's what I want to read. I don't know when those... Says on the Sauron card. At the start of each turn, you can play a Sauron card with one consequence, or draw a Sauron card, or apply one Nazgul card. Mm. Also, at the start of play a turn, you may decide not to play a card from your hand. Instead of draw one card. Oh, that's you just took that. You just said that. I'm just trying to remember when you get new Sauron cards or new Nazgul cards. That's what I want to read. Oh, 
know when you get new Nazgul cards. If you are a Siren player and you are activated, then instead of playing one card from your hand, And that's when cards are really bad. Mm-hmm. The symbol in the, in the upper left hand corner is applied. And then the other stuff. Wow. Okay. The Sauron expansion introduces a new threat to the Fellowship, the Black Rider. The Black Rider starts in Mordor, step 15 of the Corruption Line, and advances as a consequence of Sauron and Nazgul cards being played by the Sauron player. If the Black Rider encounters the Ringbearer's Hobbit for the first time in a scenario, by being on a safe space or beyond on the Corruption Line, the Sauron player takes the following actions. The Sauron player turns the Black Rider figure around to face in the direction of Mordor. The Sauron player receives one Nazgul card from the deck and displays it face up. The ring bearer must activate Sauron instead of rolling the die. If the Black Rider's movement causes the encounter, the Black Rider stops on the ring bearer's step. If the ring bearer's movement leads to the encounter, the ring bearer's movement does not stop on the Black Rider's step. If the Black Rider succeeds in returning to Mordor within the same scenario after encountering the ring bearer, the Fellowship encounters the big eye and the game ends. Not playing cards. The active player has the option not to play the allowed one or two cards on their turn, but to choose the activity, not playing cards instead. This allows the player to do several things. One, he can draw two Hobbit cards, or they can move their Hobbit back on the Corruption line in their one space, or push the Black Rider back up the three steps against the direction it faces, or defeat the leftmost foe, or place a Fellowship piece. So I have a lot of options ahead of me. Mm -hmm. And it's very, very tough. Like I said, we're just doing this to go crazy. This is not ideal. It's not how you'd probably normally want to do it. Probably wanna, you probably wouldn't want to use battlefields. And you probably wouldn't, if we're doing like two players, not play this many um, characters, like all five. Mm -hmm. But we decided just to do it, to go crazy with it, to show it to you. You know, like I said, I have no chance of winning here. It's just... This game, you know, it's hard anyway. You saw, if you saw our other videos, you know, it's hard to win anyway. You only won once out of three times. Yeah. So, all right. Why don't I, uh, why don't we start? All right. Actually, it's the start of the turn. So, actually, you activate. All right. A Sauron card. So, um, it's the start of Frodo's turn right now. Correct. So I'm going to go Frodo, Sam, Mary, Pip, and Fatty, just like in order of how they do it. Yeah. Well, I don't think it would work how if I played a Sauron card with a Dyson. Oh, wait, we got to do this stuff first, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay, we haven't started saying Sorry, that's it's been a week. All right, so what's the first thing's called? Oh, uh, Gandalf. Each player receives six Hobbit cards. Okay, so why don't you deal out five piles of six. You've got the Hobbit cards. Alright. Frodo. You might as well pick it up in your hand if you want. What, do you want me to do it, buddy? Uh, sure, you can. Uh, just to go a little quicker. Yep, Frodo, Sam, Mary, Pippin, Fatty. So it's one, two, 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 three, 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 four. Six, 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 six. And this would be Frodo. Sam. Mary. Pippin. And the Fatty. Okay. Then what's the next thing? Preparations. Ring bear may, um. Normally, it's roll the dice. Yeah, but instead of rolling dice, it'd be activating, activating Sauron. Sauron. Yeah, ring bear may activate Sauron and reveal four Hobbit cards face up for distribution. Now, what makes that really tough is 
at least on this dice, when you roll the die, there's a blank spot. You can actually maybe get away with something, but that's not the case on the on the Sauron cards. Yep. Um. Do I want to do that? Do you? I don't know, do I? I don't know, do you? Do I? Do you? Um. Yeah, it's just a game, I don't care. Go ahead. Alright. So, I'm active. I guess I will play this Sauron card. Okay, hold on one second. I'm almost done. Let me just kind of put these in some semblance of order. Okay, so you can see here, it's got a picture. I have to suffer the three, the black rider moves three spaces forward. Yep. And, and Frodo moves one step on the corruption line. And that goes in your discard pile. I'm going to form a discard pile somewhere over there. Now hand out four cards face up. Four. Hobbit, Hobbit cards, yeah. Alright. Because we're doing preparations. We're still in um, bag end right now, people. Alright. You can distribute those between your peoples. Peoples. Alright, there, what's the next step? What's the next Alright, next is Nazgul appears. Yeah. One player discard two hiding icons or Sauron moves one step on the corruption line. Pippin will get rid of the two Hobbit cards. Just form a discard pile next to that. So deck. they are hiding cards, so yeah. Sauron does not move. So now we advance the activity marker. Yep, and now we're in Brie. No, Brie. Oh, Brie. Oh, yeah, because we're playing Friends the, the board. Yes. Now you activate. Yes. So. I guess I will play this Sauron card. Okay. It probably wouldn't work that I would activate again. So, I'm assuming this would mean that you have, have to roll the dice. Right. Because it's probably not just a card that makes me activate when I'm already active. The Fellowship player instructed to roll that since he must activate the Sauron player. That is really kind of odd, actually. Oh, wait. Actually, I do get, like, better stuff, actually, if if it's the start of my turn rather than if it's a die roll. What do you mean? What's the better stuff? Yeah, like, it says at the start of my turn, I can play a Sauron card with one consequence. Or draw a Sauron card, or apply a Nazgul card, and it says instead of a die roll, I can play one Sauron card with full consequences, or refresh to six cards. Okay, so I guess that's what you can do. You yeah. can refresh up to six with six cards. Yeah, because I don't have any Sauron cards. Right, so this one goes away though. Yep. Okay. All right. Yeah, there's no die rolling anymore. Yep. Okay, while he's doing that, Frodo's going to actually activate. So I have a choice to play two cards, one white and one gray. 
Or I can defeat the leftmost foe, or I can place a fellowship piece, I can move back on a corruption line. A lot of things I can do here. I think... I think I'm going to play two cards. Alright. I'll play a well, great... Well, hold on. Um, you need to... Oh, yeah, I almost forgot about the nastiness. I thought it was kind of easy. Hit yeah. the draw from the eventile bag. Mm -hmm. I thought something odd was going on. Yeah. Siren activates. Alright, nice. So, since I get to have full consequences, I will play this card. Which means the Black Rider moves four, and you have to move two spaces on the corruption line. Well, that's pretty horrible. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so this can be a quick game, people. Yep. I have to choose. I'm gonna move Sauron one. All right. Yeah. That would probably be a better idea. First event. <coughs> What's it called? Borrow downs. Okay. All right, three foes appear. The Hill Trolls, Old Man Willow, and Wargs of Kaz, of Varegs of Kond. And then active player may um, activate Sauron to receive Tom Bombadil card and may discard it instantly to defeat any two foes. All right, I'll activate Sauron. Alright, cool. So, I get full consequences again because it's a die roll symbol. So, I will play... Hold on. Where'd I go, huh? I will play this card. Which says um, that the Black Rider moves four and you have to move up one. Are you gonna I'm just going to do one? this card. After a Sauron card is played against any one player, the player only needs to select one consequence and fully satisfy it. Alright. So I'm going to pick just uh, four of those up one. Wow, right. that really sucks already. Yeah. I haven't even moved on the activity line yet. Yeah. <laughs> that Your is so... Your hasn't even, like... I know. ...started yet. Okay, there we go. So, combat, that's... Mm -hmm. Alright. Pick up the tile. Yeah, pick up the tile. And I do get a shield. Alright. And then... I'm going to play a white. Oh, wait. Um, you activated Sauron, so you get Tom Bombadil, and you may discard it to in immediately defeat two foes. Which I'm going to do Yeah. to get rid of these two. Yeah, these two, actually. So I'll discard Tom Bombadil. Okay. Now it's my turn. See, there's a lot when you use all your spells. Like I said, ideally you wouldn't do like this, but we're just doing it for the fun of it. Alright, I'm going to play two friendship cards, a white and a gray. Alright. And I get the farmer maggot and a ring token. Alright. So... Farmer maggot.
rain token. All right, and I think that was my turn. Sounds good. So all these are going to a discard pile, and it is now Sam's. But Sarn Sorry. activates. Play. Oh this. wait, I forgot to do the tile. Forgot about the tile. So the brown one goes on four. So it goes on four. Okay. And that's a nasty one. It does mm -hmm. double damage. Mm-hmm. Okay. Alright, so I will play this card to make the black rider move three. Jesus, he's already almost on me. It's just gonna be a very, very short game. Mm-hmm. Uh, now it's Sam to pull the events. Yep. Hiding. So I do get a shield. And the leftmost foe appears. Oh, three wilds. You gotta be kidding. Goes on Sam. I'm not gonna play any cards, so I'm gonna have place a fellowship piece and I'll put Gandalf. Nice. What does Gandalf do again? He See? instantly defeats any opponent who stands on him. Right, but is he blocked? Is that only charging? No. He, he does not block. He just defeats any opponent who Yep, does not block. Yep, you're correct. I pretty good. Alright. That's me hitting the table like a crazy person. It's usually I sit over there. So this goes away. Alright. Uh, it is... Your turn. Oh no, now I can play two cards. Oh no, I chose not to play cards. Okay. What did you choose to do? I put Gandalf on. Oh yeah, you did. Yes. Alright. Okay. So you activate. Yep, I'll activate. So for one consequence. I will play this card to make you move one space on the corruption line. Oh, thanks. Who's going, Mary? Yes. That's Frodo. Yes. Alright. Okay. Oh, I think I screwed up. So it's Mary's turn, right? You uh, activated, yep. so I gotta draw an event tile. Yep. The event. Alright. Prancing Pony in. The ring bearer may discard one ring token to receive Gandalf's letter. And we'll get rid of one ring token. Alright. Gandalf's letter. Ooh, that's going to be handy. Yeah. Alright. Draw another tile. Oh, that's just great. The Nazgul strike at Bree. If hiding complete, then active player receives build a pony. I am close. Otherwise, Sauron moves for each hiding place still to be covered. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
That's what happened last time. It's like, that's ridiculous. Yeah. I, I mean, even if we went, I can only be possibly here. It's the most I can possibly be if I had all them fellowship. Well, no, that's not true. It's only my third player. I can only be at here, regardless. All right, whatever. I have to draw another token. Friendship. I get Parliament Butterbur. All right. Okay. And this is Mary? Uh, maybe. Yes. Yeah, it's Mary's turn. What does Mary want to do? I'm going to play a card, a white card on this main line. I get a shield. I get a shield. Oh yeah, you get a shield. And then... I'm gonna do. No, I can't do that. Actually. Oh no. Yes, I'm going to play a gray friendship. Move on here. I get Strider and the red arrow. Cool. So give me Strider. Strider. And then give me the red arrow, gotcha. which is one of those special ones. Yep. What's the one I missed over there? Bill a Prancing Pony? Or Bill, Bill a Pony? Bill Pony, yeah. What does that look like? It looks like this. Alright, well I'm gonna use the red arrow right now. Active player may add to the hand one feature card displayed for the scenario. So I'm gonna trim so this Bill one Pony? in. Bill a Pony? Yep. Alright. Get Bill a Pony. What does he do? One player to use this card as one shield or one life token. Oh, that's cool. And I think that's about all I can do. Alright. So that goes in the discard. And I flip this tile. Brown moves one. Okay. And is defeated. So he's face down. And he's face down. And you get yeah. to move backwards. Oh, that's cool. And to move one. And then green activates on two. Green activates on two. Right. I almost vomited. <coughs> Alright, that's all I can do. Alright. And uh, it's gonna be Pippin's turn. So. Sauron activates. All right. So, build a pony. He lets you you have one player use him as a shield or life token. Correct. All right. Oh, I am picking these tiles. Oh yeah. That's not good. So we're going to have to do a little bit of retconning here, people. Three tiles. Well, that one was a... So this one, he would have died. Gray will be on. At where? Three. And then purple will be on three. I can't go to three. So I'll go to four. Yes. Because brown would have moved first. So you do it in, in order of the swords. Then I drew a blank here. And then that one makes green. Green would go there. So Which means... Mary, remove one. Okay, we're all caught up. Sorry about that, people.
Yep. All right. Um. It's Pippin's turn. Pippin. So, so you I activate. activate. Yes. Mm. I'll use this card. Okay. To make you move one space on the corruption line. Alright. Oh, I gotta draw the event tile. attack at weather top. Each player discard one fighting and one shield otherwise <coughs> Sauron activates. I guess Sauron's gonna activate. Yep. So I'll start with um I think it says yeah each player discard that one or Sauron activates for them. So why doesn't Frodo go first? I mean, it activate twice then. So it'll activate two times on this turn. Yeah. Otherwise, roll the dice would be the original thing. What's the next event? Happened. Um, Ring Bear discard one um token, then roll the dice or activate Sauron. Otherwise, Sauron moves two spaces. Jesus creepers! I'm already yeah. hammered here. I can't do all of that. Alright, so, let's do this. You can try and prevent Sauron from that. Fro Frodo will card that in the shield. So that goes away. So Sauron does not activate Sam for Frodo. Sam will do it. Sauron does not activate for Sam. Mary will use a wild. And remember, you have build a pony that can be used as a shield. Yep. Yeah. And here's Pippin. And Fatty's out of luck. Alright, so Saren will activate for our Fatty. So. Um, it's instead of die roll, so I'll just, I guess I'll play this card. It says, um, the black rider moves three, and you have to discard two life tokens, but you don't have any life tokens, nope. so I guess nothing else. One, he reached the ring mare, so I'll turn around. Two, three. <laughs> I'm doomed. Yeah. All right, so that goes away. Especially next turn, you're doomed. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm going to play this bonus card here. Oops, that's not the one I wanted. Where is it? Is it the other bonus card? I'll that have we to have? do that one. Oh, never mind. All right, well, screw it. Yep. All right, here comes the next event tile. Man, just getting hammered here. All right. That goes to me. Yes, it does. So, Ring Bear must discard one ring token and Sauron activates. Sam will activate Valor. After a player moved the event marker, roll the die and take the full consequences, then the event is ignored. So Sam will take the consequences of one of your Sauron cards. All right. I don't have any Sauron cards, so... I am going to refresh up to six cards. Ooh, that's a great one. You're in 
in trouble next turn. You are really in trouble. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this is gonna be a short game. Yeah, you're in trouble next turn. Yeah, that's all right. I have to draw another token. Mhm. Mm <laughs> Discard three hump cards or an event. And we don't want that to happen. Yep. Three other cards. Alright. Alright, let's do the next event. Yep. Like I said, ideally this wouldn't be like this. Sauron thing is very difficult. We're not even using the dark event tiles. Yeah. Dang. <laughs> Just rolling bad cards, man. Look how uh -huh. close Sauron is. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Sauron moves or Sauron activates. Sauron's gonna move. Gotcha. It's the fifth bad tile in a row. Yay, traveling. I get a ring. Nice, and you also get this. I don't even know which turn it is anymore. It's. Pippins? Yeah. yeah. I haven't even gone through a full round yet. Not even everybody has activated. Look, it's, it's almost. Pippins. It's almost over with already. Yep, it's Pippins' turn. Okay. Pippin. What's Pippin gonna do? Big Pippin. You're gonna lose, I think. Yep. That's what you're gonna do. Mm-hmm. That's right. Just imagine, one of your actions you can do is just forfeit and lose. No, it doesn't say that. No. That's not what it does. Use Gandalf's letter, call one Gandalf card without discarding fire shields. Mm. This could be bad. I'm going to play reinforcement, place any two fellowship pieces on the board. Oh, okay, that's not so bad. Well, I mean, I don't know what else to do here. I'm going to do Aragorn here and Legolas there. Yeah, it's probably a waste of a thing, but nothing I can do about it. And then Pippin will one on the friendship line. And one on the hiding. I could play any two cards, I don't need white and gray. So I get the firebrand and a heart. Here's a heart. This is your heart. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And here's the firebrand. Okay. Alright, is that it? Yeah, finally. Then you're in big trouble. <laughs> Rider moves four. Oh no, he's almost at Mordor. Next, Bewitch. Each player discard a wild icon or Sauron activates. That's crazy. 
Yep. I don't think we're doing that wrong. It can't be every single player be activates Sarn every single time. You know what I mean? I mean, I think each player has to do that or he activates. I don't think I can do it as... I just lost six cards. Or four, eight cards and, and four shields. Four cards and four... You know what I'm saying? Well, it says each player. Right, it has to do that. It doesn't say each player has to do this every time. You know what I mean? Same like that. Yeah. I think that would be the way it goes, though. No, that's like I said, it's four shields and four cards. That would be five Hobbit cards and five shields for one event. Same with this. It would be five cards and five shields. Or five wild cards. I think as a group, if we can't, if we can't get rid of... First of all, got this many players. I don't think it's possible, but we'll keep playing that way, but I don't think that's correct at all, actually. All right. Well, go ahead. Yeah, that can't be right. Well, I can't do it. I'm not going to do it. All right, so... Yeah, no, we got to change this. That can't be right. Okay. I, I mean, say like even over there. That, that just can't be right. Yeah. Well, I mean, this was intended to have each player roll the die. No. So it's each player, if they cannot do it, then you get to, the then, they, then you roll the dice. That's how it was intended, because right. it was before the Sauron expansion. Oh, I so see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. Also, the Nazgul, the Nazgul cards are really, like, overpowered. All right, there's my five wilds. Wow. You actually had five wilds. Yeah, well, pff, that kills me out of everything. I didn't expect that. No, but especially the Inquisition. That right, goes away. Yep. So, how did you activate? Um, because it was the start of Fast. Oh, turn. I forgot to do these tiles. Oh, yeah. So, let's do that. Purple moves to. You cannot move there. So he moves here. Which does whatever that weirdo symbol does. Oh, I think you draw one of these. I think so too, but from the bottom of the uh yeah, give it to me. Alright. So and then it moves too, right? Yeah. Yeah. So Sauron so activates. Here. Yep. Alright. You're about to lose, because guess what card I'm gonna play? I don't know. This one. Black Rider moves five. Okay, before you move, I'm going to play... Oh, he's got that card. Black Rider does not move. Alright, so Black Rider does not move. But it's the full consequences, so Sauron also moves. Okay. And I'm going to play Watchful Pieces for the heck of it. Sauron moves, moves back. Three steps on the corruption line. That's the player's blue one. Yeah. Okay. So I gotta finish doing the tiles. Purple. There was another one. All right. And then black comes on. And number four. I mean, do kind of charging, but there's no charging to do. Yeah. And the next tile is a blank. And the next tile, gray moves one. And he cannot move towards Aragorn. So he moves here. Yes. Yeah, it's a red one. So Fatty gets to go. Yeah. And you already activated because we kind of did that a little bit out of order. Yeah, friendship. Yeah, friendship. I got a ring. All right, here's a ring.
Hmm. I'm in trouble here. Yeah, you're in trouble. Mm-hmm. Can I do... I cannot even play two cards. Mm, and you can draw two cards. Mm. Or you could Can't defeat the back, leftmost foe. foe. Place a fellowship piece. If you had two wild symbols, then you could defeat that guy. Not two wild symbols either. <laughs> um, hmm. What is I going to do? Don't know. You could move the Black Rider back three spaces. Well, while I think about that, I am going to do resourcefulness. Discard this card instead of three shields or fewer. I'm going to get rid of this foe. Mm. You could have just... One of the actions you could have taken was defeat the leftmost foe. I'm going to defeat the leftmost foe. Ah. Uh. Um, unfortunately, that's about all I can do. Yeah, that's the action. Yeah. That's an action. Yeah, I made it around. One round I made it. So nice. So go ahead, um, Siren activates. I'm going to play this card and make the Black Rider move four. Oh, that's just great. Yeah. It's only one consequence, so you don't have to get rid of it. Yeah, that's right. Only one consequence. <laughs> All right. Hey, hiding. Where's hiding? Hiding. I got a sun. Nice. You are the sun. I am the sun. <laughs> Actually, you have a son. <laughs> you have a son. I am going to play... A card. Two travels. So I get two rings. But also two of those. Yeah, so give me two rings. Oh yes, two rings. Hmm. And I'm going to play this as a wild. Move here. Take this. I move two sets back on the corruption line. Gotcha. And then I also get the Glorfindel card. Alright. Here you go. Have Glorfindel. Thanks. And then I am going to put on the ring. Gotcha. I mean, it's probably killing what I got on this to do. This so is I'm where I actually roll. <sighs> One spot, and I ignore it. Okay, I'll do it roll a three. I roll the worst dice roll I could possibly roll. Yep. <sighs> That's the worst outcome I could have possibly had. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, that didn't work out the way I thought it would. Yep. So now it's Sam's turn? No, I might as well just play. I'm going to play Determination. During any player's turn, advance one activity marker by one space and use it for yourself. I'm going to advance this. Alright, here you get three I shields. I do get three shields. And I get a heart, heart token. You have a heart. I do have a heart. Yes, you this do. This goes away. Alright. It's your turn. You just lost. Yep. I'm going to play this card. That's freaking impossible. Makes the black I never even got through one scenario. Yep. That's impossible. That's crazy with you a sign. You barely extension. even got through half of one scenario. I know. Oh, wait, I didn't even do uh, for those thing. Black moves one. 
Yep. But it can, so it'll move this way, which yeah. means here you go, have another thing. Thanks. You're welcome. Then Black moves three. Okay. Um, Sauron activates, so I would have so played done that. that, which would have also done the full consequences, so you'd have to move two. If I wouldn't be there, that would have been. Yeah. No, you would have. It would be the, the, the end of I wouldn't have rolled the dice. Oh yeah, you're right, you are right. This is the end of my turn, actually. Yes. And then, um, Black would have moved three times, so Black would have moved again. And then again. And then you would have been a third one, which would have been blank. So I still lost no matter what I did. Yep. That's insanity. Yep. <laughs> like I said, we just did that for the fun of it. We don't, like I said, ideally we wouldn't even have the battlefield board, honestly. Yeah. You know, because that's kind of what was killing me, too. So you almost died in like two different ways. Yeah. Battlefield is very, very tough. Well, actually, just for the hell of it, I'll, I'll put on the one ring and give it to Sam. Just to, you know. Yeah, Sam has the ring. I just want to borrow it. I don't want to keep it. All right. Well, he's um, going to keep it and he's going to run away. Never even got to Rivendell. Yeah. <laughs> that is horrendous. Yep. It was absolutely terrible. Yeah. And like I said, you probably yeah, you know, probably wouldn't want to do five fellowship players. Yep. Four would be I think the max and you wouldn't want to do battlefields with this. Yeah. But it was fun. Just to kinda of show you guys what it is and he cleaned my butt. Yep. So yeah, this game is a very fun game. I'm not even gonna bother putting a score on that because that's just silly. Yep. Um Yeah, I annihilated you. You know what? I will keep a score on it. I don't even care. Alright. It'll be fun to look at it, you know, in several years. So we gotta find the score sheets. And like a card that with full consequences would make you move three on the corruption line. A card that would make you move two as well as the Black Rider moves three. And another card that would make you move two on the corruption line. Do you know what a score sheet is actually? Um, I'm not sure. Did you know where the score sheet is? No, I guess I can tell it and we'll find it later. Alright. My score will be... 6... <laughs> 7... Oh, you don't even count those. 6. Yeah, I don't even... I know you don't count the shields, I don't think. It's just six. And shields do not count. So what about from and floaters? You do count the number of defeated foes. So that would be six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Damn, I was doing good on that because I skipped some things. That's what I was trying to look at. Mm -hmm. You know, the foes don't come up very often. And so again, I'm getting a score of ten. Alright. Never drew one of these big shields or nothing. Yep. Alright. You well, never even completed the scenario. Never even got close. Yeah. Alright, it was cool. We'll see you next time. Yep.